Let's do a prank on our buddy's computer. We're going to make it look like their desktop is frozen and they can't click any of their desktop icons. So first what we want to do is take a screenshot. Um, I'm pushing print screen on my keyboard. I'm going into GIMP. I'm going to do Control V for paste. We're going to want to put a hidden folder right here with all their desktop icons because we don't want to be too mean and just delete everything. We need an icon that blends in with the background. So I'm going to I should just crop it. Crop 32 by 32. Actually, bef before we do that, before we make that, let's just save this image. We're going to use this image as their new background. Um, in the new GIMP, you want to export and not save. I have an old GIMP. I'm going to call it cheekybg.png. Defaults are good. Okay, now we're going to make the icon for the hidden folder and we want it 32 by 32. There we go. And we'll save this as an icon file, ICO. Defaults are fine. Now we can quit GIMP. We want to make a new folder here. And we want there to be no text in the name. Um, you could just do something simple like a period. No, it doesn't let you do periods. What I like to do is go to the um, character map and find a character that's blank or at least very small, like a dot. Or some one of these might do the trick. Yeah, let's use that. Copy this. There we go. That is pretty much invisible. All right. Now we're going to change the folder icon to our custom folder icon that'll blend in with the background. And there it goes. The folder's disappeared. Now take all the desktop shortcuts except for recycling bin. Oh, I have an extra recycling bin. I'm just going to cut these find this folder, paste it into the folder. There we go. There's only the recycling bin left. And then now all you have to do is change the desktop background to our cheeky BG. There we go. We have a bunch of unclickable icons and your friend will have no idea what's wrong. And they'll probably restart their several. Their, they'll probably restart their computer several times before they figure out they've been pranked. <laughs> what happened to your desktop icons? They all disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> so your desktop icons mysteriously, mysteriously. <laughs> so I thought it was at first. I thought it was a virus, but I was like, what? This was on Steam Greenlight. Yeah. And I was like, and I went to get their alpha. And then I was like, maybe it was not good for Windows XP support, but it works. And then I was like, I was, I had many browsers and I was doing a lot of stuff at the time. Uh huh. And so I was like, maybe that interfered with the install. And all my, I guess, but I figured it out. I figured it out. All my files got put into a folder. Like that. <laughs> 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 Did you see the camouflage folder? Yeah, it's weird. Did you make it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wait, why would you do that? <laughs> it was a prank. <laughs> it was a prank.